Although the smart city concept has been around for more than two decades, thanks to significant marketing investments by major technology vendors a decade ago, governments around the world have become attracted to its promise to help solve their increasingly complex and costly urban problems. Under the name Smart Cities, the notion that data-driven evidence-based decision-making will make their cities more efficient, secure, convenient, and cost-effective, city governments and technology vendors have deployed sensors, routers, meters, and monitors to optimize and predict the best outcomes for their cities. In essence, smart city efforts make cities work better. They apply information and communications technology to accurately monitor, measure, and control city processes, from the punctuality of transit services to the quality of the air and water supplies, and from the security of bridge construction to the performance of electric grids. Smart cities are about saving money, becoming more efficient, and delivering better service to the taxpayer. But connected smart infrastructure is only a piece of the urban puzzle. Science and technology needs to be balanced with creative people, opportunities to educate society to fill the ever-changing skills gap and involve everyone in the community to ensure social inclusion and digital equality. We call these intelligent communities. As our communities will be disrupted with new applications ranging from autonomous vehicles and artificial intelligence to the Internet of Things and impact of the blockchain, it will be increasingly important to look holistically at our urban planning and community development processes. People must be at the heart of these decisions, leading, championing and aspiring their communities to become vibrant, sustainable and brilliant cities that will attract and sustain talent, jobs and investment. In essence, intelligent communities are different from smart cities. Intelligent communities adopt technology but do not make it their focus. They take the longer view to make their communities better, whether they are large urban centers or smaller rural towns and villages, where citizens of all ages and employers thrive and prosper in the broadband economy. Every intelligent community has smart city projects underway. But many smart cities, limiting themselves to the immediate efficiency and cost benefits of ICT, have yet to take the first steps toward becoming intelligent communities. But it's not too late for them to do so. And by doing so, they can join a growing global family of intelligent communities.